Good evening. I've just woken up and I just decided I'm going to vlog the next few days because I've got quite a lot going on. And also I'm kind of shitting myself for some of the things that are coming up. So I thought I'd just bring you along with me so I don't feel as scared. Let's catch up, shall we? I'm obviously back in London. My lease isn't up here until the end of July, I think. Also, I think I'm going to have to spend the whole... Oh my God, my foot. Also, I think I'm going to have to spend the whole of August in London, but we'll get into that in another time. I am a wee bit homesick. I do love it here. It is really fun, but it's just very intense. And I did book a flight home next weekend. <laughs> Anyway, back to this vlog, um, I woke up and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go to a fucking Pilates class. <laughs> Why did I say it like that? Why am I yummy mummy? Like, who do I think I am? Like, I am the leader of the PTA. I'm literally heading to a fucking Pilates class. I looked up, like, cool exercise classes in London, and this was the first one that came up. It's called Carve, I think. And apparently it's quite, like, soul cycle in the way that it's, like, dim lights, like, club lights, really loud music, but it's kind of, like, reformer Pilates instead of soul cycle because I hate soul cycle because it hurts my vagina. I'm going to that today. Quite excited. Going on my own, though. That's why I'm bringing you with me because I'm quite nervous. I don't like going places on my own. And then also tomorrow we've got an event. I should picture this. I'm sitting in Belfast. I'm just sunbathing. Also, I've been sunbathing so much. Probably not very good for me, but it has worked because I've got a great tan from England Sun. Who would have thought? Anyway, imagine this. Sitting in Belfast, just scrolling through my phone. I'm scrolling through my message requests and Maisie Williams has messaged me and I'm like, what, what possible reason could Maisie Williams have to message me? Why does this girl know who I am? Anyway, she invited me to this event. It's, apparently it's London Fashion Week, apparently next week. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. But she said it's London Fashion Week event. She's like, I'm, I'm inviting you to it because I'm like DJing at it. And I was like, Okay, interesting. I'm obviously gonna go. Well, this is the thing. I've asked if I can bring a plus one, because if I can't bring a plus one, I can't go to this like London Fashion Week kind of event on my own. I won't know anyone. I'm out of my depth here, guys. I'm completely out of my depth. What the fuck do you wear? Like, I don't know. Like, it's London Fashion Week. Like, that is like, you need to wear something. Oh, guys, like, I can't. I physically can't do this. Look at me. I, I'm not going to Maisie Williams London Fashion Week event. It's not fucking happening. Bit worrying. No joking, I was actually just opening packages this morning. I got this new bottle from Shreddy, you know Grace Fitz brand. Oh, it's actually not Grace Fit anymore, it's Grace Beverly. It's called Shreddy and look how big this bottle is. I'm gonna bring that to my Pilates class. Every time I say Pilates, I'm like, shut the fuck up, Olivia. But I think it's gonna be fun. Anyway, we should probably go because we probably will be late. That was my cover of, what song is it? I have no idea, this is the one. Scissor, you got school tomorrow. I wore this outfit in my last video and said I'm gonna start Pilates and y'all doubted me. But here I am. Constantly. I'm gonna drive there now. I've actually got a new playlist to show you guys, so I'll show you in the car, do a bit of a carpal karaoke. This next part of the vlog is actual chaos. If you can hear the little beat, basically, something hit on my dashboard and I had a full on meltdown. It's Lola in the background. But yeah, I had a full on meltdown. <laughs> What does that mean? Wait, I've got a flat tire. Wait, where do I pull over? There's nowhere to pull over. The whole dashboard's gone red and it says, check tire. Oh gosh, gosh, golly gosh. Hello. Mom, I'm driving here and then it just came up on my dashboard all in red and it was like, check your tires. Don't worry, go to where you're going. You don't have to do it this second. Oh, Mom, I thought I was going to have to pull it into the side of the road. No, 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 you're all right. All righty. Yeah. Go have your Pilates class. Yes, I'm very nervous for that as well. Don't be nervous, but it's meant to be for fun and enjoyment. Okay. My life, my life, my life, my life in the sunshine. I just got a Gales. I've talked about Gales before. Look at my fucking hair. I got an iced oat milk latte. Tiny as ever. Literally like cost me four quid for about three mouthfuls of liquid. I absolutely loved it and I will be returning. But yeah, I know it was so much fun and, and it was all girls. Like everyone was wearing their wee really cute like sports bras and leggings. I just, I don't know. There were sausage dogs. I loved it. There was also a wee cafe in the place. My camera died, but just overall review, 10 out of 10. And I had to rush home for a meeting.
that's why I wasn't chatting on the way home, sorry. Hey guys, so the next part of this video is kindly sponsored by Function of Beauty. Function of Beauty is an amazing hair care brand. I've literally been using it for so long. I swear by it. What's so good about it is it's completely like personalized. Cause like when you think about it, like no one has the exact same hair goals. Like if you just go to a shop and buy like a generic shampoo, like how is that meant to fit your hair goals? Do you know what I mean? So what's so cool about Function of Beauty is when you go on the website, you take a really short, easy, like two minute quiz and you tell them your hair goals, your hair type, you choose the scent, you choose like how strong you want the scent, you can choose the colors, they come in the prettiest colors. These are two new bottles I got recently. I actually did just wash my hair there today. That's why it's all like nice and fluffy. I feel like my hair goes so nice and fluffy and soft whenever I use the shampoo and conditioner, but I actually had two open bottles already in my shower, hence why these are actually unopened. So for example, like on my relief kit that comes with the shampoo and conditioner, I said I had like medium, normal hair, my goals, I wanted to deep condition, fix split ends because I do bleach my hair. So <laughs> hydrate, lengthen and replenish hair. And it does exactly that. Like my hair is so soft when I use Function of Beauty. Also, you can get a leave-in treatment or a hair mask or a hair serum. I got the hair mask this time. Sometimes I do get the hair serum. It does, this is the thing, it lasts you so long. Like it takes me so long to use up a Function of Beauty bottle. This is the hair serum. I use it every day. I use it when my hair is wet. I use it after I style it. Just because I've got like extensions, you need to like always add moisture into the ends because it's not really getting that natural like oil from your scalp so yeah that's i love the serum i literally use it all day every day it's so nice yeah if you're looking to maybe like up your hair care a wee bit get something a bit more personalized instead of it's like a random one from the shop then i would definitely suggest checking out function of beauty the packaging is amazing the quality is amazing i can't recommend it enough so yeah i will leave a link in my description if you want to check out function of beauty and maybe get your own wee bottle okay i've finished my meeting i'm now waiting for my uber because i am going shopping with my friends we're gonna go to brick lane and like in short it and get some nice wee vintage pieces. So this is my outfit for today. I've got this motel shirt on, this wee vest up from Brandy. I am obsessed with the fit of this vest. And then these shorts are cotton on. And this hat is Von Dutch, but I got it in Urban Outfitters. I'm literally like starving because I obviously haven't eaten since breakfast because I had to come straight home and do that meeting. The second I get over my Uber, I am literally running to Pret and getting my favorite wrap ever. My favorite wrap is the hummus and chipotle wrap. Oh, I don't do well with long periods of not eating. Like, I swear, I don't eat for like two hours and my tummy's like, Wah! Okay, I finally made it. I was 50 minutes late, but like, who is counting? So I'm getting, I'm getting some vegan dumplings from there. And then there's a vegan soft serve place over there and I'm really excited. Yeah, I'm gonna get the vegan soft serve. This is Lolita. These are my dumplings. I got pickles and spring onion and sweet chili sauce. I'm so excited. Woo! Let's see your- bad bitch walk here. No. Peanut butter. Thank you. It's got a vegan bueno on it. Uh, can I get the peanut butter cup with the vegan bread in it? Thank you so much. Oh my much. god, it's bussing. <laughs> what the fuck? We're in Brickley and Vintage Market and now we're gonna try on dresses that we all picked for each other because we are, we, yeah, for prom. We got prom, we got prom in the morning. We're living in Wild Child. You know that scene from Wild Child? They're like, who are we? That's us. Taking to prom, baby. I'm Oh no, I'm not looking very fresh. I'm fucking exhausted. I don't usually exercise, but when I do exercise, it takes it out of me. I know I need to get ready because we're leaving, I think in an hour, to go to my friend's birthday party. And it's on a rooftop, very fancy. I actually did get two things. I really want to wear them tonight, but I don't know if it's a bit too casual. Like, do I look like I'm going to work? You'll see what I mean. But anyway, I'm gonna do a makeup transition, like a hair transition, and then we'll decide on an outfit together. Hi. Hey. I'm ready. Do you know how I use the Refi stuff on my eyebrows now? It's like soap brow in a tube. It's really, really good. I would recommend Re Re Refi Beauty. Um, it's by Jess Hunt on Instagram. But she also brought out this new cream bronzer and cream blusher. And I've been using the shade Citrine. And oh my God, it is so nice. I'm usually not a blush girl, but it's like 
quite like orangey, like it kind of blends into your bronzer for summer. It's, a, it's an age, it's an age. I didn't end up wearing the stuff I got today because everyone else is wearing dresses. I think it might be quite fancy where we're going. So I ended up wearing this dress. I do know the brand of it, but I don't really like the brand anymore. So I'm not gonna tell you where it is, but it's just a black coil neck dress. You can find one anywhere. It's coil neck and it's kind of like, it does look a bit like a bin bag. I also like, don't own bras. The only bra I have is from when I was like 15 and I really wanted boobs. And I got the Victoria's Secret bombshell bra because I remember someone said Kylie Jenner had it when realistically, she probably just had plastic surgery, but anyway, I bought it. So I am currently wearing a Victoria's Secret bombshell bra. Didn't think I would ever be wearing it again, but here we are. It's only black bra I own, and I kind of needed to wear a black one because I'm wearing a black dress. Oh, do you want to see what I got anyway from... Because, oh my God, I literally look like I have boobs. It's not real. Don't believe anything you see on the internet. These are the trousers I was talking about. So they're kind of like satiny work straight leg trousers from... Fendi, but they're like vintage Fendi, so they were not that expensive, don't worry. But yeah, I got them in Bricklane Vintage Market. It's so cool in there, I really, really like it. Like, maybe my designer clothes, who would have thought? Oh, okay, I changed. I wasn't comfortable in that dress at all. Like, my boobs that were, actually my boobs kept showing, and I was like, ah, get away. I've changed into this dress. I just feel like it's a bit more me. I just feel much more comfortable in it. You should always wear what makes you feel most comfortable, girlies. Was there shit in my nail? Anyway, not actual shit. This dress is from Zara, but I got it last summer, so I don't know if it will still be in stock, but I need to go because our Uber's here, but yeah. Love you. Cheers. Hi, feeling fresh, feeling good. It's three o'clock now. I'm meant to be going to that thing at eight o'clock, that London Fashion Week thing, but I've got told that you're not allowed any plus ones, and I literally, I fucking, I hate myself. Like, I genuinely do, because I wish I could go, because I bet you there's so many cool people there, but I don't know one person going. So, this, like, the thought of showing up there, like, I would genuinely pass out from nerves. Like, imagine me walking in, like, not knowing anyone, just kind of, like, standing there, like, sitting on my phone. Let's not dwell on it, because... I'm a stupid bitch. I'm now sat at the car wash. I'm gonna ask if they can like fill up, what's it, the air? Because I still haven't fixed that thing that happened yesterday to my car, so I'm gonna see if they can do it as well. And then I'm going to meet Lola and Nyla at a park and we're gonna sunbathe because it is like 20, 28 degrees today, I think. Okay, I fucking, oh, I love this sun. It puts me in such a good mood. Oh my God, can I update you on something? Okay, so I got my vaccine. I talked about it loads about how excited I was to get this stuff but then I never actually told you how it went so let me give you a quick rundown obviously so fucking happy I got well one dose done well oh, oh god I've got so much to tell you okay so now I got AstraZeneca if I can give you one piece of advice in, in my whole for my whole YouTube channel please just get the Pfizer vaccine AstraZeneca sucks ass it's not the end of the world if you have to get AstraZeneca because I, you are fine after like a few hours but that few hours I was like I I see the light I'm about to die. My whole family got the Pfizer vaccine and didn't have one symptom. But then whenever I was booking my vaccine, it was like, do you opt into getting AstraZeneca? And I was like, I literally, I had no idea what either of the vaccines were. I didn't read into it. Probably should have because I'm literally putting it in my body. But I, I just didn't give a fuck. I just wanted to be vaccinated. Uh, so I opted in for AstraZeneca. I just thought it would make me be able to get one quicker. I don't I don't know what was going through my head. And yeah, it just kind of floored me. Like I had the worst like fever of my life. John stayed over. He had like sponged me down that night. Like I was lying there being like please stop playing the guitar and he was like what the fuck like i'm i don't have a guitar and then for like two days after i got my vaccine my lips were tingling and i was like i'm literally having an allergic reaction like nothing swole i didn't get any like rashes but my lips were just tingling and i was like i kept saying to john like oh my lips are tingling he's like shut up you're just being dramatic like why would your lips be tingling and i was like all right i'm either about to have an allergic reaction or i'm about to have a stroke so neither outcomes are really good of course the allergic reaction then came and my lip filler kind of blew up i had seen that happening on tiktok and then i came out in all these hives all over me and it was so itchy and i came out with this big rash and then it went away after an hour it was so bizarre and it also like the first time when i got that flu like I, I went to sleep and then i woke up completely fine like there was nothing wrong with me it was shit but at the end of the day it's like i can sacrifice at night for it do you know what i mean like I, i'm not gonna get well I, you know it's only 70 percent effective but like still it's better than zero percent effective do you know what i mean uh, but it's 100 percent effective and not putting you in the hospital oh my god and then the second part of the story was i put up on my story like you get a wee car when you're vaccinated i put it up on my story it was like yeah like how people get vaccinated and then i kept getting these texts being like your, your second vaccination has been cancelled like from the nhs and i was like has someone gone on, like, used some number that they saw on my card and fucking cancel my second appointment to get my vaccination? I still haven't quite figured out what's going on. I don't even know if I've got a second vaccination book. Not because I genuinely think someone might have done that. That's really not nice. Hey! I'm vlogging again! Hi, vlog. And She's bad. We're sunbathing in Primary's house. I'm sweating so much. Why are you coming fast? 
see Brandon's stuff. Hey. Hey. hey guys, how are you? I am sweating so much. I've got butt sweat, I've got back sweat. It's not as like I have a bad sore. We are now gonna go to Tesco's and get some food because we're having a barbecue in Lola's. Uh, maybe I have some Aperol spritz. We made some Aperol spritz recently. Oh, that's really rude. <laughs> Thank you. Hey. You're right. Like, Let's go to Tesco. I'm potentially okay. go to Starbucks and get a wee green peach, peach green sea lemonade. Yeah, we'll but then up. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay, so we are back at Lola's. Um, we're about to start the barbecue, except we figured out we can't we can't work out the barbecue. Yeah, no, so we have to buy the disposal. Yeah, we're not cut out for it. So we bought the disposal ones that you can get from Tesco, and I had to borrow a dress because I didn't actually realise that we were going to be having a barbecue tonight. So I've got this really cute one on. I borrowed it from Lola from is it Realisation? Yeah, Realisation. I actually recently ordered two, which was a bit painful on the bank account. Not gonna lie, and I can't wait for them to come because they're just the cutest summer dresses ever. And you got a Realisation one on as well, yeah, haven't you? Right. Oh, okay. Oh, you look so pretty! Wow! Now this. 